Yes, a sad day. A sad day all in around. Isengard is no longer independent. It would appear that... The Haradrim, they sent me an offer I just simply could not refuse. But hey, it, it, would, it would appear I'm back in their good grace due to the fact that we're allies. Now that... That is incredibly good. Besides, all the land over here don't need it. It's the land all the way up here that I need, and besides, I have Edoras. Let's uh, look at the requirements again. I need Isengard, I have it. The Hornburg, I have it. Edoras, I have it. Bree and Mikael Delving don't have it, and they're up there. So I simply... and Rohan is dead, so I just simply need 45 regions. I just need to make up the numbers, and I can do that by expanding northwest, so long as... So long, uh, so long as the Haradrim leave me alone. You have to think, yeah, there's also Dunland to think about as well. Let's go back up here, and we'll see how long this will last. And it looks like we don't need Grima to talk to them anymore. So hopefully, hopefully this will last. Because if we're in a glitch then the Haradrim will simply attack next turn or two turns after, which means I will be forever stuck in perpetual warfare with them, which would be just catastrophic. Simply catastrophic. Okay, what are they going to do? They're talking? No, they're not. And they didn't, move, they didn't make a move towards Entwade either. But at the same time... At the same time, the Haradrim could win this as well. Although, I'm not sure if the territories held by a client kingdom count towards the territories that they need. I could be completely wrong about that. I could be incredibly wrong about that. In which case, every territory I capture while under their, uh, while under their, uh, vassalship, you know, I could be, I could be helping them win the campaign. Which is fucking tragic, in my opinion. Get ready for fighting. Is that what you want? Oh, no sleeping here. Pick your feet up. Oh, well, a good change of pace, though, would be to go on the offensive for once and take out some Dunland cities. Because really, the Dunland, I said it before, they should they should have started out as my client kingdom, or I just should have started out with their lands, you know, completely. I don't know. Complete. It's end turn again. I don't think there's much I can do. Up here, the elves look to be going away, although this... Oh, wait! No, 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 no. This is not good. Yeah, this isn't good at all. It would appear that, uh, as soon as the Haradrim give me some leeway, we get, uh, completely gang-raped by two other factions. Wonderful. Fucking, um, just, just wonderful. That's all I can say. Uh, it's never an easy day in this game. Tired of ordering your own forces. Oh, there are Arnor as well, which means the kingdom was must have been refor must have been reforged fucking ages ago by this stage. So we have high elves and we have Eridor Eridorians. Awesome. Do I remind you of one of your own captains? Oh, catapults too. Catapults. So I only have a wooden wall defending this anyway. Mm, not good at all. Not good at all. Send that turn. Hopefully the high elves will hold off for a bit. If not, my, I'm certainly at risk at losing both Tarabads. Ah oh, no! Not Dunyard. I've held it for so long, and it was woefully under garrisoned. Well played, High Elves. Well played. You look at South Tarbad, you see a target that is too difficult for you to take, so you go and look to bully the little guy. What assholes. Ah oh well, could have been worse. They could have Mumikil, and they don't. So that instantly means I have a chance. Let's talk to them. And that was Skype again, my apologies. Yes. Let's let's talk to them, shall we?
Yes. We shall listen to Mr. Rastortian. It's the best I could do. Rastortian. Just think about what you're doing here, mate. You're attacking a pretty powerful... Okay, Skype is going haywire. Just give me a second. And we're back. So, anyway. Yes, Mr. Rastortian. Think about what you're doing. You're attacking... Someone who used to have the backing of the most powerful being in Middle-earth. Now, I could get that backing back, so you think about that, mister. Hmm. Right. Ceasefire. Very demanding. Wankers. Trade rights. Merely demanding. A tribute. <laughs> Christ, what does this remind you of? I will give you four grand. Four grand for you to back off for even just ten turns. That's balanced. Good. Take it. Do you think me a mindless surf? You ask too but, much. But it said dolt, not surf. And it was balanced. You prick. We hope for more fruitful parlay. Do you know how? Future. You're idiots. The two of you, idiots. You've let yourselves so open to my wrath. Oh god, I have no cavalry. How would it I catch them? Honor defeating you. Either way. Orcs, Either way. You die now. Okay, that was idiotic of me. I merely, uh... I merely, uh, separated them. Okay, uh, in my opinion now, this is a throwaway battle. I mean, it's against one guy. 31 guys you want to get specific uh, yeah I'm gonna stop recording here you don't need to see this uh, I'll let you see this battle and if I get to it I'll let you see this battle down here but this battle you do not need to see in my opinion so I should be back when this man is dead so I shall see you then okay guys I'm back and I ended up getting both generals which is fantastic for me I decided you know See, seeing as they were both so close together, I think, you know, why not Why not get both of them in the one go? So that's what I did, and they're both dead. So yes, the High Elves have just lost two high-ranking generals slash family members, and that is a good, good thing all around. Now, it looks like Dunyard is under some, you know, pretty bad pressure here from, from the High Elves. They don't have a general on them, but they do have five catapults and a ballista. Whereas I have not a lot, not a lot at all, Ugh, that's bad. Unfortunately, I can't really send reinforcements down here due to pressure from the uh, Free Peoples of Everdor. So it looks like our lasting uh, truce step we had when I was uh, being attacked by the Haradrim is slowly eroding away. It would appear... Uh, yeah, it would appear support from uh, Isengard itself would be necessary, so I should probably get right on that. Get ready for fighting. Orcs! Pick your feet up! Objective complete! Hmm, two turns until another catapult. Okay, that's not bad. Listen up! Oh, that Isengard watchtower looks suspiciously Gondorian. It must have been from that tenure when uh, Dunyard was occupied. No sleeping here. We have completed. Anyway, yeah, if uh, Dunyard falls now next turn, this army should do okay to uh, retake it. And also, we also have uh, an army Get moving in on the Dunland capital, which is all good, all good. Things are finally looking semi up, and I will definitely take that over the uh, complete and utter ludicrousness of the situation we had with the Haradrim. wonder how much time I have left, actually. Should be about 400 plus turns, hopefully. Because, yeah, you, I keep forgetting that I'm working under time constraints as well. Okay, Eridor, what are you going to do? Have we crashed? No, we have not crashed. I think we've frozen, but we may not have crashed. Okay, we're good. And they will attack. With that army, I don't know why. They're and they also have, the 
They also have an army moving on Argond over to the left as well. Oh, not good at all. See, it's funny, isn't it? Apparently, if I war with the evil factions, the good factions won't touch me and vice versa. It's good to know, actually. It's very good to know. And you know what would be nice? Some fucking hospitality from my so-called allies to Haradrim. They should get armies up here to help me out. Maybe if I talk to them and get them to attack a faction, yes. That would be quite tasty. At your Trusted one. What is it you seek? Attack. Wait, no, it's me offering. No, 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 no. Demand. Yes. You will attack. Three peoples of, er of Eridor, yeah? And I will, I don't know, give some map information. How about that? Even a beggar would spit on your offering. Well, I don't know what kind of alloys you guys are, but normal alloys would, you know, help me out. And I failed a mission, apparently. I don't give a shit. I truly could not care about Sauron spitting right now. I have my own problems, Sauron, as you can see. Come on! Objective, come no sleep in here! Pick your feet up! Hmm. Okay, what do they have? Just have some infantry and what about here? Any siege engines? Most likely, but it doesn't look like uh, there might be any. Oh no! Argond! How long have I held you? Oh, a pretty sizable archer contingent though. Argond is pretty well defended, in my opinion. Is it a castle? It is. So a castle equals better defenses. Now oh, look at that, that is a hell of a castle. And it would be very nice to have. Shall we attack a castle? What do they have? <laughs> Piffed. <laughs> That's what I say to that. A raspberry I blow upon to thee. Okay. 5 to 2 in my favour. Time will not be on my side here. Let's fight this battle and take over this castle. This castle will be a good boon for me to have. It looks very well upgraded, which means it will have several uh, layers of wall for me to go through. Let's see how the AI behaves during this. Oh wait. Yep, several layers of wall. Two by the looks of it. Yep, two. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Oh wait. Or is it three? No, it looks to be two. Yeah, it's two. Fair enough. Let's get our tree catapults up here and make some lines with the other guys. Okay, we have our general here. Like a sizable archer contingent. We'll put him here, maybe. Uh, infantry contingent to protect our left flank. Catapults will go up here, obviously. We'll go through this chunk of the wall, maybe. That wouldn't be too bad. Uh, who am I forgetting? I'm forgetting a lot. Put the uh, general behind the catapults. Uh, see, we have these guys left. We'll put these guys over here, maybe. Then we'll select them all and drag them over to where the catapults are. That seems fair. Put them here, thereabouts. That's good. And who are you? Archers. Put them right here. Okay. Let's take these walls out. And where are they? They're right there with their own catapults. And we also have the majority of them behind the second wall. I should be able, if I'm quick enough, I should be able to take out their catapults with my uh, wargs. Depending whether or not they stay turtled up in behind the uh, second wall. Okay. Let's take it out. Yes, it's going to go down pretty, pretty easily. Especially since it's uh, three catapults. And now for both towers, so they won't hamper my uh, progress. They're moving their catapults back. That's quite clever of them. It's one tower. Let's get the other tower. Shouldn't take long. Okay, they're both gone. 
Right, let's get our men in here. They're definitely pulling back fully. Yep, they are. Quite clever. Quite, quite clever. Pull, uh... Let's see, how do I, how do I want to approach this? I mean, I suppose this would be the best way, actually. Yeah, it's literally a straight line. Okay, no problem. Uh, it's going to be a bit crowded. That's fine. Probably can I position three cats here at all? Even one? Yeah, I can put one there. Can I put one here? Not really. No, no, I can, I can. Okay, if I put two in here, put the other one back at the entrance for uh, safekeeping just in case. Put Leave him here. Then we'll get our men in here to defend the catapults as they uh, come in. Oh, it's going to be so awkward to handle. I can't really afford to uh, use finesse here in terms of uh, in terms of setting up troops because there just is no room. That's the simple truth of it. Yeah, I have to say again, very clever of them to bring their catapults back in. No doubt they'll, uh, no doubt they'll attack as I attempt to uh, bring the walls down. They will have a decent target, although they will not have line of sight. But line of sight really counts for bullshit when you have a CPU making the calculations. So. Okay, they're coming in. Should be getting the, uh... No, 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 no! What are you doing? You're gonna get hit! Are they getting hit? They're not getting hit. That's a good sign. Wonder why that is. Huh, fair enough. I'll take it. I'd expect... Uh, yeah, probably because we've come through a breach, maybe? That could be a thing. We're going different paths here, by the looks of it. Where they're going, I have no idea. No idea what they're doing. At all. If you could come down this way, maybe? No, apparently that's out of bounds to him. Okay, why don't you follow the path down here, then? Nope, you won't do that either. Probably because uh, we have a catapult here blocking their way. That's fine. We'll take this catapult, then. Yeah, as I said, it was going to be a horrible clusterfuck. Time's still on my side, though. It's still well on my side. Could I put him here, maybe? Yeah, that'd be best. If I could somehow just maneuver properly. Oh, it's so difficult. Actually, here would be quite good. Yeah, definitely put him here. Put both of them here, actually. Yeah, I can definitely go with that. Uh, no, I said boat. Oh wait, no, no, all of them are coming up. No, you stay there. That was a horrible blunder on my part. Uh, yeah, as I said before, I want to get boats from, like, right about here. That uh, bollocks, anyway. Can I get him here at least? I think that's where he was originally going. Well, he's going there anyway, so he's no choice. Okay, well this should be pretty eventful now when the catapults get in. 